So today I have the pleasure of speaking with the brand new president of the North Valley Regional Chamber of Commerce, Mrs. Nikki Bassey. So Nikki Bassey, brand new president of the North Valley Regional Chamber of Commerce, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> so nice to have you here. This is so great. So tell me, how's it going? It's good. We've been very busy. It's been a very busy six weeks. So March 1st, I became president and we became the North Valley Regional Chamber of Commerce. So this is the reason why we changed our name back from Northridge Chamber of Commerce to North Valley Regional. We have members all over the North Valley and we really wanted the name to reflect it so that everyone felt that they were a part of the chamber that they belonged to. So our, our home, our heart is still Northridge, but our name now reflects all of our members. So uh, thank you for sharing that. That's, that's terrific. Now I'm curious now, what is it that you're most excited about in the near future? One thing that I know maybe sounds a little bit crazy that I took on right away is the big event that we're doing on May 2nd. It's called Heroes in Education. And we are going to be awarding and recognizing eight local educators. They are our heroes in education. And Nancy, I have spent the last three days some of the most fun I've ever had in my life going into the classrooms and surprising the teachers and telling them that out of hundreds of nominations, there were 18 schools that participated, that you are the principal of the year or you are the gym teacher of the year or the teacher of the year. And it has been amazing. It's been the biggest blessing. This event is so important and timely because of the teacher strike that we just had recently. And I feel like it's so important for us to show our support. These are the people who are investing in our children every day and they're gonna be creating the society that we're all living in. And so we just felt like there was a place for this event. We're trying to get the whole community involved and all the businesses to support. We have elected officials coming and it's very, very exciting. <laughs> I love that. I love that. I love that you're taking responsibility not only for the small businesses mm -hmm. in our area, but really it, it helps to make the community tighter yeah. and really makes it a true group. It's the students saying what these teachers have done to make an right. impact in them. It's the parents saying, the changes that they've seen in their sons and their daughters, whether it be academically and in many cases socially. These, these teachers are investing in their ultimate success. They're teaching them all of the skills that they need to be successful. It was the students and the parents who were able to nominate the teachers and they wrote in the most compelling nominations we were so touched and and just tearing up while we're reading them so how are the small businesses contributing to that so we have many of our small businesses who are doing sponsorships mm. and we are putting together it's going to take a truck for these teachers to take home everything that they're going to win we were oh. given these amazing carts and we filled up those carts and things just keep coming in and oh, coming wow. in and we are accepting everything. There is gifts anywhere from things for their classrooms, which are so necessary because many of these teachers spend their own money to buy the supplies that are necessary for them to do their jobs. So not only are we giving them everything they could need for their classroom, but we're also giving them many things that are gonna be things that they can use to pamper themselves oh. and, and have some fun and our businesses are really really stepping up oh okay good so how did you come to be at the chamber then what's your background so I started working at a different chamber and I started as their communications coordinator I was working 10 hours a week I was sending out their emails I was very happy to do so I had just re-entered the workforce from being a stay-at-home mom and I love working so it was fun and they thought I did well. So they asked me to be the membership director. Um, at first I was very nervous because I didn't know if I'd be any good at it, but I told them I would try and I had so much fun. I started making amazing relationships. Then at Northridge Chamber, the previous president, Stephanie and I actually had a conversation 
and this chamber was just alive mm. and they were doing some really amazing things and it was something that I wanted to be a part of. So I came on to work as Stephanie, work with Stephanie and I thought well I'll learn from her for a really long time and we'll see where that all goes. So on day three she told me and revealed her secret that she actually wanted to retire and she was hoping that I would take over. And I was shocked and I asked her when, <laughs> but we worked together for a year and a half and Stephanie was really passionate about the chamber staying relevant. There are so many networking groups right now that sometimes people will be members of eight or more. Yeah. And so what I really intend to do is to build in so much value into our chamber that there's no question. They don't need to be a member of eight different networking mm -hmm. groups. Our chamber will provide all of the opportunities they need for their business to really flourish in our community, which will bless the community as well. That makes so much sense. It, it kind of economizes for the small business owners, right? Mm -hmm. And one last question. Tell me, please tell me that in five years you're still going to be here. I'll definitely still be here. I can't imagine going anywhere. I am having so much fun. I feel like I'm doing exactly what I'm supposed to do. And it's a lot of work. It's, it's, it's a very hard job, but it is wonderful. Everything I do is fun and we're just gonna be here for our businesses. So as long as there's still businesses in the North Valley region, we're gonna be here supporting for them. We're gonna be advocating for them. We're gonna be providing better business practices for them. And we're gonna be a part of organizations that are advocating for them at the state and national level. And I'll still be here. Nikki, such a pleasure having this conversation. I think more people are going to be more interested in the North Valley Regional Chamber of Commerce than ever. Thanks to you. So we're so Thank glad you. you're here. You. Welcome. Thank Welcome. you so much. <laughs>